What's going on everybody? Patriot Stacker here. So I got a couple really cool pieces that I want to show you. They're not coins, but some are coin collecting related, some stuff for my uh, silver stacking. I got a mail call and I also have a really cool item that I bought from a fellow silver stacking community member. So first off, I got this thing here, which I think is super cool. It is an American flag treasure chest. So I picked this up from that store called Hobby Lobby. Uh, if you've never been to a Hobby Lobby, definitely check it out if you have any any of those in your uh, in your area. But they have like sales all the time and this was 50% off. I think it was normally $15. I got it for 7.50 and you know for seven bucks, not a bad deal for this really cool American flag treasure chest. I thought this thing was appropriate for the channel. I uh, put a few things in here, some uh, wheat penny things and some of my uh, peace dollars and Morgan dollars. But just for now, I'm gonna figure out something cool to do with this. But I thought that was cool. I wanted to show you guys my, my patriotic treasure chest. So that was really awesome. I also have a mail call here. So this is a little season's greetings, a little Christmas card from a fellow stacker. Let's see here. From Silver Oceans, thank you for all your support in 2021. Merry Christmas. Stack wide as the ocean. So Oceans is awesome, dude. He's got an amazing channel. He does really, really awesome analysis of the market. You know, he's really knowledgeable about about silver and gold and precious metals. So definitely check out his channel, subscribe and check out his videos. He's got a little uh, little collage of all of his little stickers and logos there. And he also included a sticker here. Silver oceans stack wide as the ocean. He's got a sweet little toner Benji at the bottom there. Really, really awesome. I wonder if that's him surfing. That'd be pretty cool. I'll have to ask him about that. Or if you watch this, Oceans, let me know. Is that you surfing in the picture? That'd be pretty awesome. So we got a nice little Christmas card from my good friend, Silver Oceans. Like I said, check out his channel. He's got awesome content. Really, really knowledgeable and great info about the silver and gold and precious metals market. So check him out. Next, I said I got an item from a local silver stacking YouTube community member. So that person or people, I should say, is Metal Merchant, which you probably know, but if you don't know, Metal Merchant is the collaboration uh, precious metals store. They're precious metals dealers, and that's Silver Husky and DOA, Director of Awesome. So these two guys got together, be, uh, started Metal Merchant, which is an awesome uh, precious metals dealer. And they have YouTube auctions and they do all different stuff uh, on other platforms as well besides YouTube. But Silver Husky, which I've known for quite a while, as well as DOA, two really awesome guys. And, uh, you know, their company, Metal Merchant. So they, uh, they usually deal in the precious metals. But Silver Husky, I think uh, he made this product, but he came up with, or maybe they both did, a coin collecting silver stacking 1,000 piece puzzle, jigsaw puzzle. How cool is that? I saw he posted on Instagram talking about this limited, uh, you know, puzzle that he had made and they were selling them on their eBay store. And it was very inexpensive. I mean, it was around 20 bucks, $25, you know, which isn't too bad for a puzzle. I mean, you know, puzzles are pretty expensive nowadays. And the fact that, you know, we're supporting the metal merchant guys, DOA and Silver Husky, and also that it's a puzzle with all this awesome silver and gold coins all over the puzzle. How awesome is that? So I'm gonna do a video where we're putting this together. So stay tuned for that. That's gonna be a lot of fun. So really, really cool. I mean, a silver stacking puzzle. 
I think that's the most amazing thing I've seen all year. How cool is that? This would make an awesome Christmas present, holiday present for somebody, uh, you know, for a fellow stacker or, you know, or something just to pick up to, uh, to get your family or your children, you know, to hang out and put a puzzle together and get to check out all those cool silver and gold coins. How awesome is that? So that was from the Metal Merchant Boys, Silver Husky, and DOA. Thanks, guys. I love the puzzle. It is so cool. I can't wait to put it together. So I also have a few other items that I recently picked up from a flea market. So it was a uh, flea market I went to. I actually went there about a month ago, so I've had these for a little while, but I, I haven't shown them yet on the channel. And I got these for a killer deal. So they are Whitman Classic. These really nice Whitman Classic coin folders. So here we have the 1892 through 1921. This is the, the folder number two for the Morgan dollars. Brand new in the packaging. These things are brand new. So I got the Morgan, uh, Morgan Dollar Book 2. I also got uh, Morgan Dollar Book 1, 1878 through 1891. Really nice, really nice heavy-duty archive quality folders. You know, very similar to the Dansko folders. Really, really nice. So I got both Morgan books. I also got the Peace Dollar Book, also brand new, still sealed in the plastic. Really nice. And that holds all the Peace Dollars. I also got the Walking Liberty Half Dollars. Same deal, same type of folder, Whitman Classic, uh, brand new in the plastic. And this is the 1916 through 1947, so that's all of the Walking Liberty Half Dollars. And lastly, I got a Dansko album, which is the American Silver Eagle Dansko folder. And this holds all the American Silver Eagles starting in 1986. And I'm not sure how far it goes up to. I don't know when uh, they this was this book was made, but it probably goes up somewhere to somewhere in the 2000s. And really, really cool. Also brand new in the plastic. And I got all of these books for. I, I'm, I'm, I'm afraid to even say how much I paid for these because it's crazy. But like I said, these were from a uh, flea market. And the guy was selling, he had some coins, you know, a handful of coins, nothing crazy. He had a whole bunch of other stuff, antiques and different, you know, typical flea market stuff. But I paid $2 a piece for these folders. That's pretty insane, right? Two bucks a piece. This Dansko album sells for at least $35. There's even an old price tag here for $27. And that's that's pretty, uh, that looks like a little bit of an older tag too. So two bucks a piece for all of these brand new in the plastic coin folders. How awesome is that? So for 10 bucks, I got five awesome, brand new archive quality coin folders. So I was really excited to show you all about, show you all those. You know, I thought that was such an awesome deal and I was really excited to pick those up. So I'm, I'm debating whether I want to fill those folders or maybe I'll just hold on to them to resell at a later time. I'm not exactly sure because I already have a couple of those folders. So, or similar ones, uh, but not as nice as those. So I'm not sure if I want to pull all my coins out of the folder I have them. Uh, they're just like the basic Whitman folders, not the ones that are as, not as nice as those ones. So I'm not sure. We'll see. I might just uh, try to resell those later on. But those are my pickups. You know, I was really, really excited about this coin puzzle. I mean, that is so cool. I was actually uh, at the store with my wife, and we were looking for Christmas presents and stuff. And there was a whole uh, store that was selling like a million different puzzles. And they had all different kinds uh, all different themes, you know, m different movies and music and pop culture and all different stuff. And I was looking everywhere for something that had to do with coins. And they didn't have any, which is really, uh, you know, it's kind of crazy because you think coin collecting, it's a pretty big hobby. They actually had a puzzle with all different stamps on them. 
And I feel like stamp collecting has kind of faded away and coin collecting is still a pretty strong hobby nowadays. But they didn't have any puzzles that had to do with coins. And then a couple days later, Silver Husky posted about this puzzle and I had to buy it. I thought it was awesome. And, you know, definitely excited about my new patriotic treasure chest. This thing was super cool from Hobby Lobby, you know, for only like seven bucks. And then, of course, the awesome mail call from my good brother, Silver Oceans. He's an awesome dude with a great channel. Definitely check him out. So that's my video for today. Just wanted to show off a couple items. I thought they were pretty cool. Um, I haven't picked up much silver or gold in the last week or two. Hopefully I'm going to get to my coin shop tomorrow or the next day. Uh, we'll see. Hopefully I can get over there. But that's pretty much it for today. Hope you enjoyed checking out all my stuff. And thanks for watching today's video. Smash that like button if you enjoyed what you saw. Subscribe to the channel if you like videos all about silver stacking, coin collecting, precious metals, treasure hunting, and all that fun stuff. And ring that notification bell so you can see when I upload my next video. And as always, have a great day.